So I've been looking for work, right? Just a little bit, because there's so little I can do. I'm so limited. I can't drive. I live in an assisted living. I literally only have energy two, three hours a day. And a couple times a week, I use that to go to the gym. I'm not giving that up. It's the only time I get out of the house. People congratulate me when they see me at the gym. That's so good of you to still go to the gym when you're in a wheelchair. No, it was more impressive when I went to the gym when I could walk. Because I was getting exercise every day. I was living a busy life. I was doing stuff. So it was more impressive when I made it to the gym. When I was walking and working and living. Now it's literally the only thing I do. The only time I get out of the house. Of course I'm going to go to the gym. Duh. But yeah, congratulate me if you want. I sort of don't want the accolades. I'm just living, people. I'm just... I'm just doing the best I can with a shitty situation. I'm not doing any different than you would. Don't give me accolades for living. You're doing it too. So I'm trying to look for work. And all I'm coming across is MLMs. Utah's prime for MLMs. Stay-at-home moms are a huge target for them. And yeah, I put money into one because I bought the product and then she told me it was an MLM after she had um, assured me that it wasn't. Cute. I didn't realize how much I said cute until one of the staff here started making fun of me for it. I say it all the time. Whatever. It's adorable. I say that too. So the other options, well, there's an online tutoring position for English uh, that I'm interviewing for on Monday, phone interview. Fingers crossed, because I have a degree in that. The other interview I have is phone sex operator. My nickname at every phone job was 900, because apparently I sounded like a phone sex operator. Yeah, one time at the real estate agent place, I used the intercom after I'd been there for two months. Dude comes running down the stairs, looking around for the hot new secretary, and I'm like, still me, just me. And he's like, wow, your phone voice is amazing. Thanks, bro. I'm, it's still just me. So, maybe it'll be that. Who knows? So, I researched the fetishes because they asked me to. There are some sick bastards out there. And ironically enough, there were not very many older women in the granny fetish section. Yeah, there were pictures of women on this site. My picture's not going up there. Oh, hells no. I mean, if that's what I end up doing. Fingers crossed for the tutoring English, because that's what I have a degree in. I don't have a degree in phone sex operator, even though I did go to kind of a crappy school. But it's accredited, so yeah. So I want to use my degree. So I'm trying to do stuff, and I'm going crazy, but... I think I'm coming back from crazy, so that's good. I'm going crazy, why don't you come along? I must be crazy to sing this song. Should I sing more? Once there was a little cat and all she ate was yarn, and when her little kittens came they were born with sweaters on. I don't remember the song, it's a camp song from when I was like 12. Anyway. I'm going crazy, so join me.